Hello Air Signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Thank you for tuning in to your tarot reading. We're going to be looking at the person who ghosted you. Okay, so this is the one that disappeared without a trace. You don't really know what happened or maybe they've been back and forth. They come back, they ghost, they come back, they ghost. Um, we'll have a look and see what's going on with this person. Okay, what are they thinking and feeling and why would they do this to you? So this can be for the air signs. Um, or if you have heavy air sign placement in your chart, uh, and also those dealing with an air sign as well. So um, this reading can be for you. So let's try to get some cards out to get a better understanding of what's going through this person's mind when they ghost you or when they ghosted you. Um, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel. Uh, and also if you are after a private reading, my details are below. Um, otherwise, let's jump into this. Okay, let's lay out some cards. Okay. All right, this page is really standing out to me here, and I'm seeing there's a bit of immaturity. Okay, pages are inexperienced when it comes to love or inexperienced in certain situations. Um, and I feel like this is telling me this person there's there's a certain immaturity about them when it comes to love okay i feel like with the queen of swords and the page of pentacles um they like talking to you but they're not open to a certain commitment that you are and they they know that you want commitment they know you want to move forward okay because in air energy you're coming up two of swords queen of swords six of swords Okay, that's your air energy. So, okay, for some of you, it's a situation that this person isn't over their ex. Okay, we've got the moon. The moon can be the past. Um, I want to say that this person has options. They're being immature and they have options around them and they're not ready to commit to one as yet. Queen of Swords, they're talking to a lot of different people. Okay, people they've met at work, people they've met out. Um, maybe it's a, they need an ego boost and this would point to this person being insecure air signs um, okay because I'm seeing options three of pentacles two of wands when something goes wrong with your connection they ghost you and they go run to this other, other person they think that okay you guys aren't going well they're gonna run to another person it's not a long-term solution and it's probably quite worrisome that this person is doing that um, you know, because they're not laying down foundations with you. They're, you know, they're jumping online. They're seeing who they have. They're scrolling through their phone and they're looking at their other little numbers going, okay, who can I unblock? Who can I contact? Who can I distract myself from this air sign? Now I need a distraction. So I don't know, air signs, pretty immature. Do you want to be with someone like this? Um, you know, I feel like they have a lot of growing up to do. They've got lessons in love, I feel. Um, lessons in love that they need to sort of work through okay that they haven't done as yet and you know i don't know if they're younger they could be younger may not have much experience in love or wisdom but they don't realize they're hurting you they come back you guys fight you know you say why did you block why did you do this you know you try to fight for your dignity here and this person just doesn't get it there appears to be some sort of block here um to be honest, I feel like there might be something they're not telling you entirely. I feel like this person is wanting to keep their options open. And, you know, when you come up and you're like, why did you block? And why did you do this? And where did you go? And you're, you know, you're standing up for yourself. This person just isn't getting it. To them, they don't actually realize that they've hurt you. And there you are, you know, you're defensive and you're upset. Um, and all those sorts of emotions come up the moon. Emotions, strong emotions come up. And then you're like, okay, yes, let's move forward. Um, let's, let's keep, you know, let's move forward. Let's grow from this, but that's your mindset. It's not necessarily theirs. So I'm seeing this is going to keep being a cycle. Um, air signs. I feel like you need to break away from this person entirely. You need to detach and your, your energy and attention needs to go elsewhere. I feel like with a high priestess, you know, sometimes she's like a test. 
your intuition is telling you you need to back away from this person and not even bother and give them time anymore but you're still doing it maybe a part of you feels hopeful that this person will one day turn around and want a relationship um not necessarily the case right now in this kind of energy their energy is that they're playing the field they're keeping their options open they're loving the freedom okay they like queen of uh, queen of swords flirts with everyone okay they like to be in that energy right now let them do it okay they'll probably find someone who's probably doing the same thing to them um you know it's karmic energy karma comes back around that the high priestess is here i feel like they're going to get their karma air signs you won't have to worry about that um okay they could have a complex problem here got the five of cups uh sorry five of pentacles this you know i feel like deep down it comes to some sort of neglect or insecurity they've had um this was way before you though air signs and i feel like with the eight of swords they're jeopardizing this relationship this connection they jeopardized it i feel um two of cups the, the two of you could have had something significant but again it's their loss it's not yours um got the nine of pentacles here you know she's telling the parrot to be quiet There's some secretive behavior going on with this person i don't think they're entirely trustworthy so they're probably not as trustworthy as you thought they would be um you know six of swords has come up twice i think a part of them too wants to move forward whether it's but i get a sense it's like they want to move on entirely um, is there attachment here? Probably not strong enough to make them want to stay or to make them want to come back. Even if they did, air signs, it's going to be up to you whether you want to take them back or not. Um, again, chances are it's probably like they went out, they got with someone else, they hooked up with them, or that person isn't as interested. They're not like you, air signs. Maybe they're not as caring. Um, they're not as attracted to them. And then, you know, they come right back to you, especially for those that this person keeps doing this to you. You know, you need to break the cycle or they'll just keep taking advantage because in their eyes, they can go out and talk to whoever they want and, and meet whoever they want and, and you know, act single. Um, but then they go and ghost and it's like, well, what is going on? You know, and it's impacting you in the long run. You are suffering. Um, really, it's their issue. It's their insecurities. Um, and, you know, they're uncertainty and then it you know it, it gives you sleepless nights and it gives you stress and it gives you this imbalance and you know we don't need that air signs we're better than this we're stronger than this we don't want to be in that five of pentacles energy you know they're not giving you stability right now they don't they, it's not what they can offer and even if you force them to give that stability it's still not going to be what you want um page of pentacles has come up here but it's reversed okay again pointing to a lot of that immaturity that's coming up here you need to let them go because they have lessons to learn they need to grow they need to develop but they need to do that in their own time there's nothing you can teach or instill in this person it has to be their own journey you can try but you probably won't get too far it's not to say nothing things can't change in the future they can but in this present energy this person has options open, they're playing around, they're non-committal, <clears throat> someone is distracting them and they go for it, even though they know it hurts you, okay, so it could be like they talk to some, um, you know, they disappear and they talk to someone that they know you're jealous of or they know that, um, you know, it's going to garner a reaction from you and, you know, it's the immature way of doing things because they can't come forward and just be like X, Y and Z. They need to play these games so but don't forget if they're playing these games with you chances are they're doing it to those people as well they're blocking and unblocking they ghost them as well so it's like how much are you really losing you know if they're doing this to everyone how much of that energy you know how how big is the loss if this person is is doing that to everyone including you it's probably better you lose them and better you disconnect entirely um at this stage i will leave it at that though air signs so thank you so much for watching really do appreciate it don't forget to like share and subscribe um and hopefully we shall be in touch again very soon so thank you again everyone and bye for now